Jack Gove, the car that splits and flies. Why have a car or a drone when you can have both? Introducing the GACGOVE, an innovative vehicle that actually splits in two. The lower half? A futuristic, compact electric automobile. The upper half? A full-fledged autonomous flying drone. Scheduled to take flight by 2027, Gove is already making waves, and not because it makes a vertical departure. It's received commercial flight certification in China and hopes to link urban metropolises by air. Cutting out all road traffic, here's what sets it apart. Flight range, approximately 200 kilometers cruising speed, 80 kilometers per hour. Completely electric VTOL capability, vertical takeoff and landing. Xpeng X2, the future flying car, the Xpeng X2 team is working at the speed of light. Last year alone, this revolutionary flying car made its maiden test flight in Beijing, just in time as the city aims to launch three low-altitude air routes by 2027 under its ambitious Urban Air Mobility UAM program. So, what can the Xpeng X2 do, exactly? This stylish electric flying car can fly as high as 1 km and as fast as 130 km per hour. It's built to seat two people, using electric power alone for propulsion, with a full charge that provides around 35 minutes of airtime. The Xpeng X2 will enter the market priced at $126,000, a significant leap toward making personal air travel a reality in the future. Joby Aviation S4, the almost here air taxi. While test models still languish in R&D, the Joby Aviation S4 is taking to the skies already. With more than 48,000 kilometers of test flight time recorded, Joby is not merely fantasizing about the future, it's creating it. This slender EVTOL, electric vertical takeoff and landing, air taxi is gearing up for certification and has concrete flight tests scheduled in Dubai this year. Here's why it could be a game changer. Top speed, 322 kilometers per hour. Range, 240 kilometers, space for passengers. Four zero emission and all electric reserve your seat in just one tap within an app and cut through traffic like never before. Joby repositions the S4. Doroni H1X, the plane that may cut your daily commute. Prepare yourself to reconsider your morning commute. Scheduled to enter the market sometime in 2026, the Doroni H1X is more than a concept. It's a working EVTOL that's already received its airworthiness certification from the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration. With a top speed of 193 kilometers per hour, and 160 kilometers per charge, the H1X zips away on city jaunts, business flights, and weekend excursions. And here's the clincher. It's so easy to pilot. Cyclotech Blackbird, the 360-degree thrust flying machine. Cyclotech just revolutionized the game in April the company test flew its Blackbird, a scaled-down model that's stirring up huge buzz in both aviation and science. Why? Because it's the world's first EVTOL to fly using cyclorotors. Goodbye to conventional propellers. These giant whirling cylinders feature blade-covered walls that continuously adapt to airflow, enabling instant thrust, no spool-up delay, full 360-degree directional control unmatched maneuverability, even in adverse weather. That translates to this cutting-edge technology potentially leaving drones and helicopters behind in responsiveness, agility, and stability. Cyclotech is not resting on its laurels. A two-seater production version is planned for release around 2035 with top speed 150 kilometers per hour.
high-end design for private bespoke buyers. This is no ordinary aircraft. It's precision flight taken to new heights. Cabaret X7, the EV that revolutionizes mid-air. The award for most futuristic aviation breakthrough goes to the Cabaret X7, a pioneering EVTOL electric vertical takeoff and landing plane that has achieved the feat of going from hovering like a drone to flying like a jet. Here's the clever bit. 14 secret fans built into its fold-up wings propel the vertical takeoff. Once airborne, those fans fold back in and the aircraft unfurls its wings, literally converting to airplane-type flight on a turboprop engine with a pusher propeller at the rear. The outcomes are breathtaking, maximum speed, 450 km per hour, flight distance, 800 km, seating capacity, 6 passengers, operating expense, approximately 30% less than a helicopter. Now in the last stages of full-scale manned prototype testing, the Cavorite X7 is on its way to becoming a game-changer for air mobility with an estimated price tag in the multi-million dollar range. Volocopter Volo City. Your future, flying taxi traffic jams are over. Volocopter's Volo City is taking air travel to the city center. This two seat EVTOL air taxi is poised to fly over crowded roads, traveling up to 20 kilometers at 100 kilometers per hour. Ideal for short city jumps, the Volo City provides a noiseless, emission free ride smoother than any ground cab. And the future? Even better. Terrafugia Transition, the audacious road to sky hybrid. Terrafugia Transition is a daring effort to merge car and airplane into one revolutionary hybrid vehicle. Initially, the group had planned to start mass production in 2019 at an estimated cost of $400,000. Yet, a series of complications held back development, and the project has been in suspended animation since. And yet, Hopes remain that the transition will finally get airborne, literally. The idea of flying from San Francisco to Los Angeles on one tank of gas is irresistibly appealing. Performance-wise, the transition does not disappoint. On the road, it can hit speeds of up to 110 km per hour, while in the air, it can go as high as 185 km per hour, making it an exceptionally versatile vehicle designed for highways and airways.